Hi, it's me again with Corel Golf's Tips and Tricks and Tips. Somebody sent me this file, and they say when they print it on a red mug, that the letters come when they UV print it. I'm going to go back a page, and we're going to put this to the back of the page like this is the red mug. And they say the letters turn out not turn out red. Well, I don't see that's possible, so I don't know. I don't know anything about printing. But what I did notice is that there are some extra colors in here that aren't needed. Whoever, if you drew this, you're way out there. That's really good. Let me uh, set my nudge factor on, like, let's see how big this is. A little bitty, so let's just make it two inches. I'm going to take that white letter and nudge it out of the way. I'm going to take the black one and nudge it out of the way. And take the... Now, look at this. If I take this black... Nudge out of the way. There's another black still there. So that's not needed. I don't know if that's going to affect. The other thing is the star is black on top of blue. So you've got many, 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 many layers there. I'm just wondering if, uh, you know, I don't, I, once again, I don't know anything about, um, uh, UV printing, but I'm going to try this right here. I'm going to get rid of this star because they want that star black. Why don't we just do this here and take the smart field tool set on, I'm using RGB. You're going to probably use CMYK for UV printing. I think you're going to have, you know, this is the same thing except for you don't have the black behind there. Now, like, you know, the letters are, you say, turn out red. I don't see how that could be possible because there's nothing behind there. Now, and then they mentioned, and I'm totally confused, that they wanted a totally white background behind everything. I don't understand, but we can do it. Take the smart fill tool, take a box. Let's use that blue. And let's, basically, we're making an outline of that shape. Now we can take this and fill it in white. Of course, you'd want to use CMYK white. And now we have a white background. Watch as it jumps by. And it didn't get down there, but that's beside the point. Order back a page. Now you have a white background behind everything. Um, it didn't quite get underneath this 2022, but if we... Um, I don't know. Let me know if this helped because I really don't know if I'm helping. Uh, you know, I found a couple of mistakes, but who said they're really mistakes? Anyway, I hope that helped them just a little bit. And thank you for watching.